Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of months, we have been talking quite in depth on the channel about a possible Windows 12 release sometime next year in 2024. And this is because there have been several sources, rumors and reports that Microsoft is working on a Windows refresh that is coming in 2024. Now, I'll leave a Windows 12 rumors playlist in the end screen of this video. Um, just on a side note, if you'd like to play catch up and would like some more info. But I thought just to post this quick video um, just to keep you in the loop because over the last couple of days, a little bit, a little bit more information has surfaced regarding the future of Windows. And be that either the Windows 11 version 24H2 feature update or a possible Windows 12 release. Now, this new information uh, that has come to light is according to a new report in the Commercial Times, which uh, suggests that Windows 12 is set to be due to launch next year in June of 2024. Now, once again, um, like all things Windows 12, there is no confirmation about this from Microsoft, although there's also no denial from Microsoft's side either. And this uh, report in the Commercial Times says, and I'm quoting, Windows 12 will be launched in June 2024 and is expected to introduce a large number of AR technologies and become the leader in AR PCs, quote unquote. Now that's an interesting statement, although not confirmed by Microsoft, because it does lean into the fact, which we have spoken about already on the channel, that Windows 12 could be an AR powered version of the operating system. And I'll leave a video I did post on that down below in the description if you'd like more info. And um, this does indicate, though, that um, obviously Windows 12 could be more AR focused because already, as many of you will know, already in Windows 11, Microsoft is focusing a lot more on introducing AR into the OS. I mean, we already have got the desktop copilot, which brings centralized AR assistance to the Windows 11 desktop. And we've also got the web copilot, as many of you will know, in Microsoft Edge, which basically does the same thing. So Microsoft already focusing on introducing a lot more AR already into Windows. So the fact that um, this report says that they are going to introduce a large number of AR technologies uh, into a possible Windows 12 is kind of heading in that direction as we have spoken about on the channel. Now over and above this, um, there's also a prediction according to this report, that a series of AR PCs will launch in quick, in quick succession next year in 2024. And this is where Microsoft is going to hook into all of this. And this is where they are going to launch their AR-focused, what we are calling new generation of Windows operating systems, which will be focused more on AR. So a lot of things are starting to line up, especially in the AR department and a future release of Windows, possibly Windows 12. Now, over and above Windows 12, what I think is going to happen here, and according to this new info, I think next year, and obviously this is just pure speculation and is not a confirmation, but I would suggest that next year we're going to get Windows 11, the annual feature update, version 24H2. So that will roll out uh, like it normally does in October, November. So that means that that will be the feature update taking version 23H2 to version 24H2. And then as this new report suggests, sometime next year, possibly in June, Microsoft will start rolling out Windows 12, which will be the next generation of Windows, which is going to focus a lot more on AR. Now, obviously, this is just pure speculation, but nonetheless, I thought you may find this interesting. Now, while we are also talking about Windows 11 version 24H2, why I say this is because um, the Windows enthusiast Zeno over on X, once again, has posted a screenshot of a new policy that gives reference to the next version of Windows 11. So if we head over to this screenshot, here we can see a, a screenshot of this policy. And it says here at the top, as we can see, enable delegated managed service account logons. And it says here, supported on at least Windows 11 version 24H2. So this is in a new policy. And obviously, this is a screenshot of that. So yeah, there are references to 
at least Windows 11 version 24H2, which is interesting. So this is why I'm saying and I'm speculating. Obviously, this is not um, so-called rock-solid evidence, but just a pure speculation that next year we are going to be getting version 24H2 as the annual Windows 11 feature update. And then sometime, possibly in June even, as the report states, we could possibly start seeing the first references and indication that Microsoft will roll out the more AI-focused and based Windows 12. But as mentioned, I'll keep it posted. And that's the latest. That's the um, information that's come to light over the last couple of days. And I just wanted to put it out there because I know a lot of you, including myself, are obviously interested in what's going to be happening next year um, with uh, the future versions, be that version 24H2 or Windows 12 of the Windows OS. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.